Yeah. Come here to carry on to True Fairy Tulip over here. Let's see what objectives are gonna come for her. Uh, I already like selected two before. Immune to gain immunity of to sickness. And like another one. Also probably the radiant objective would also be nice. Uh, let me see again. Uh, so brain freeze before I go, let me see this. Do you eat plants? But I, I made you graminivorous. He's not interested in it. And get rid of this object which is to crash his AI, so... Jesus. Don't do it, I guess. Fine, be dumped. <laughs> Let's see, uh, 232. So, 100% she should be able to fly. Have we had any other better flying objectives than just flying? S Sky boom. Loading? Ah, whatever, it's just... <laughs> flying, I'm going to back very deadly... Very risky. Radiant! What does the Radiant objective do again? Oh yeah, well if it's not listed over there, I don't know. Sending our light. Uh, I think this might give her... Oh, the... She's alive, but not like that. Yes, <laughs> not the same type of radiance I was thinking of, at the very least. See element. element. Hmm. Well, first of all, let's just make her immune so she can be immune to sickness. What was the second adjective that I said he was gonna be right for her? Ah, ideological. Yeah, that could work. Very ideological. Eight and one more related to how glorious she is or something. Inflatable. Oh wow! Let me guess. It's growing size when intellect. Grow his eyes and try interact. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that is nice. Sectivores. <laughs> Very funny. Insured. What is that? A, a cow, literally? <laughs> the Jackie Insured describes something covered by. Insurance. Now is the real drop. <laughs> really? Wow, okay, that actually. 
insured. You are insured now, okay? You see? He said small plants. Okay. I guess if I fed brain for small plants, he eats. Not big plants, small plants. But Daisy is a small plant, isn't he? But no, he's not working on brain for small plants. Insured. Interglandular. Yeah. I've already finished this list. What am I still doing over here? Next. Literate. No, no. Love. Oh! What about the natural legend? He's able to describe something found in nature. And not involving anything made or done. Oh, oh, oh. That's too fairy tulip pretty much. <laughs> this objective makes the wheel the random exposed. The bright one. Hey, this really fits to the true fairy tulip, the natural objective. We're definitely giving this to her. Natural. Hi right, done. Let's just True Fairy Tulip, how do you feel? Flying skillful, protective, brave, immune, ideological, natural. I think skip the tick. <laughs> I feel like she definitely is. Uh, the deadly adjective, uh, yeah, deadly adjective. Baby. Alright. Place it in with others. Yes. Why to fairy tree, my dear? Let's see. My mouse dies right after I pick this up. Come on! Don't have time for nonsense! Oh, freak me. No. I need the mouse. I see to play trip. Oh, don't you dare rock! Now I'm fighting as well. Mm, very good. Try to get him. Oh, but of course, we forget him. Let's give her the, uh, the true fairy to the rainbow. This is gonna be the same thing that Machikus uses as well. Except Machikus one is more violet pretty much. So uh, his is not shooting rainbow with projectiles like uh, true fairy to the sun. Well, everything's fairly right but the game cannot pick up on this apparently. Probably because it's spelled... Uh-huh, yeah, I, I know. For true fairy tulip, to me... Uh, to, from me to true fairy tulips... Invisible hitbox? He's holding it like that over which is nice. You're very too right next to my location over there. Since you were right next to my location, how about you to fight together? Yes. Fight after the red lanterns. Come on, then. 
du du du. Yani şikolatçılar koyuyor. Hiç, hiç tank şikolatçılar. Ya alright wait. I messed up. Ah Krishna you wanna eat? Yeah wait. Grab that to play trip. This was supposed to also be rainbowy. How could I forget? Now it's Yeah. Just pay to leave that should work. Alright, let's see now. And she's also pretty much able to install community. Whoa. Ad Ad Christian, what did they got you? Uh, Ad Christian is not unbeatable. How did he die? He's unbeatable. No, true fairy tulip. Attacks Abu Christian. Stop. No, I threw fairy to you. What the fuck are you doing? You can't. Oh no, fairy to attacking Abu Christian. You know I don't like to see you attack. But the first time I did, they weren't attacking each other. Accident. You can't kill Adult Christian! Uh, yeah. And Christian modification over here. But why? I can explain, I guess it's because you see this cat over here from the Red Lantern is the Dexter. He still he doesn't neutral much. So I guess to play it with so Adam Christian attack it and then destroy Adam Christian as well. Well that doesn't always happen at the very least, but it still happens. Strange, right? Is it a bad efficient ability to do that? Maybe. Eh, I don't know. Maybe, I mean they're cool now, they're not even attacking each other. Uh, I guess it's fine then. For now. They were kind of starting to attack each other as well. Mm 
can true fairy to deep insta you of course yeah this is how the projectile should look right this is exactly how we had to do that oh yeah baby So much cruz and Fairy Tulip shoot exactly the same way except True Fairy Tulip uh, has a rainbow we trail and like uh, much cruz has a more violet one if you look in the game. That's that's the just the only difference. The projectile color. Why True Fairy Tulip gets it to look like this like rainbow -y. tired <laughs> so then there you go true fairy tulip is also in next should be nearly done here fine coming to an end with this baron vended shooting rainbow <laughs> Watch out Batman, Batman with the shooting rainbows at you. Oh yeah. But Nergoli, he has his own gun. I, I just want to see this really quick because it's funny. Mm -hmm. Hey Batman. Ouch. Three. Mm -hmm. ah, and now let's go over here. Uh, obviously taking the vanded shotgun. What you can... But nice about this shotgun is that when you shoot people with this shotgun, it's also quite overpowered and you can even kill Lily. Now, the people who get shot by this shotgun do not react at all. You can shoot them with this shotgun and they will not attack you back. Which really... That's Baron Van Dead's shotgun to you. It's as if they knew they just don't stand a chance so they just don't attack. Don't, they don't mess with Baron Van Dead's shotgun like this. Look. Everyone, anyone who I shoot with the shotgun, they will not attack me back. They're too scared to do it. <laughs> like literally. The vanded shotgun, what can I say? It runs in the generation. <laughs> vanded shotgun. The vanded generation truly glorious over here. Yeah man, vanded shotgun is no joke. Kind of over most of the power weapon, probably. Alright, new character, Pan of the Dead. What adjectives, unique adjectives, uh, variations of adjectives could we give you? Somehow, Brain Freeze must have had the poorest adjectives, <laughs> but worked out. Okay. Maybe we should still give better adjectives to Brain Freeze, but. Okay. So, Pan of the Dead. Let me hand you over the shotgun. Now you're Baron Van Dead. <laughs> 100% Baron Van Dead. It's coming, fellas. <laughs> and I think Baron Van Dead gets his own costume as well. Think about it. Uh, no. I don't think he does. I, I would use that the best costume. Sad. <laughs> Uh, 
But true, we did use up the best costumes. Protective rain. Ah, I know. What about a vanded adjective? <laughs> like the vanded adjective works. Vanded, not an adjective. Come on, man, he's vanded. Van dead. Adjective. <laughs> you can make vanded expensive. <laughs> he is quite expensive. <laughs> no, man, I can't. Neurologic lying. Is Baron Van Dead a liar? He might be, who knows? <laughs> He's not lying about one thing, he's really powerful. The lunar adjective gives the wielder moon properties. <laughs> Batsy. No. Bat like? Uh. Ultrasonic. That exists, but I don't know what it does. <laughs> uh, I guess we we'll have to see. He's ultrasonic. Lunar. The lunar adjective gives the wielder moon properties. So what will this do? Astronomer will be interested in objects and with his adjective. He's not an object. Mm. We can traffic lying uh, mammalogic, mammal, uh, mammalogical. Makes the wielder curious towards it. mammals. Biology is looking back curious towards it. <laughs> what? Uh, yeah. Is Vanded curious towards animals? Who even cares about that? Man... Masonic... Masonic! Make the wheel spawn alive and randomly express the house. There will equip bricks, concrete and hammers. Fantastic! You guys got any of that? Just went around my ear, probably. Makes the wielder spawn alive and randomly express. Bricks, concrete, and hemp. So interesting, but I failed to see how this will help Varum and Dead. Master. Yeah, I've already taken that adjective. Masticated materialistic. On a large space. Equipping credit card. We are not trying to make him into a troublemaker. Mathematical. Nope. Is Baron Vendel mathematical? Well, he has the ambushing ability. It's not really that mathematical. Medicinal. Megalomaniacal. Alright, now this might work. Let me see. Megalomania is a delusional mental illness that is marked by feelings of personal omnipotence and grandeur. <laughs> Makes not living wonders, wielders sentient and randomly expressed. Runs away from asylums. <laughs> For as long as this is not an entirely bad objective, we could have him with this. Uh, <laughs> we have <laughs> bad offended megalomania. <laughs> Works. Megalomania. That's an adjective that I could give him. But he better not get attacked with this adjective one. Messy. <laughs> Messy. I <laughs> will create three of the following apple code. Right. Empty soda. <laughs> really? He doesn't pick them up, does he? He just creates them. Uh, well, we, we made them, um, we make him messy, yeah. Ultrasonic, megalomaniacal, messy. 
Oh, uh, and... Oh, I just remember one, omnipotent. Didn't I give that adjective to like one of the singularities? Omnipotent. I already know what it means, of extreme power probably, but still. Having unlimited power, yes. <laughs> we give like... <laughs> well, we give Battle of Undead <laughs> omnipotence. Yeah, give him. <laughs> he already has the deadly objective, I don't think this works. <laughs> oh gosh, come on, he got his joints bigger. He actually spawned Polo Shirt. But he's making stuff, no joke. Wait, you see? He's randomly spawning junk. Very busy. Oh. <laughs> Found a couple of junk, but then... We now have an um, omnipotent. Ah, great, he turned back to his right. Uh, well... Let's go again. Same again, I'm gonna be messy. That's not all of the objectives. <laughs> mm. Ah, these are. Then they are very unbeatable, messy, mega, vehicle, ultrasonic, brave, protective, skillful. Mm hmm. <laughs> he just found this around uh, behind him. Oh, look! Battle of Soda! So messy. Why are you so messy, Battle of the Dead? <laughs> But the ultrasonic one, I'm not sure what he did yet. He might produce a sound later on. Hmm. Here's your invincible vanded shotgun. Nice, bro. You look sick. Absolutely sick. I guess you're facing the right position over there. Yep. <laughs> hey, right next to True Fairy Tulip. Good. That's where we want you to be. <laughs> Close and personal. <laughs> Obviously, I want Baron Bender to be able to get along with 233 because if he doesn't, he's bad. And with Algor Christian as well, why why not? I'm yeah, spawning three of them. Let's just see how they get along with each other. Now, we've seen 233 attack Algor Christian sometimes after he finished attacking the bad guys. Uh, that, that doesn't always happen. Now, let's just see what's gonna be the outcome over here. Banded, uh, 233 and Algor Christian, show me the display! Show me what you're made out of. Okay, we forgot to add Fairy Tulip with uh, the rainbow magic. Yeah, alright, that's good, I guess. But first of all, all right, let me add True Fairy Tulip with the rainbow magic instead. Because we messed up and we forgot. But I thought I did not forget. Uh, and I... Forgetting, right? Ha! <laughs> For... Get ing me? Oh, you got to be joking! But oh, uh, no, I did not forget. Are uh, you chatting bullcrap? I guess I just—I must have been blind and I didn't see the rainbow. Does this shoot rainbow? It does. Uh, okay, I was blind. Sorry. Yeah, you can have it back to you to leap. Attack the bad guys! Yes, let's see one more time. Baron Vendette shotgun! Two, 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 two. He's shooting bats at them. So fast, alright. They're already done with it, mate. Slow down a bit. <laughs> right, so you are getting along with them. But Baron Vendette, I'm going to see you uh, do it so I can see it uh, better this way. Oh. Look, the bad guys. Baron Vendette. 
Ah, yes, I see how it works. Well, you two are a bit of a bad guy, right? No, uh, this one is bad, evil, monstrous, magnetic. Whoa, watch out, yeah, get him. What, uh, you ain't going for me, shot. <clears throat> Give me the van, the shotgun. Are you there? Right, step one more, and I'll shoot you to death. I did like that, sorry. Right, see. Get them Van Dead! Alright, let's get them together actually. What you can? Double Baron Van Dead with the wing. How'd you can? Whoa! No way, I got you. Got him, Baron Van Dead. Good job, mate! Mate! Your shotgun is yours. What'd you can? Ha <laughs> Actually, amazing. But he spawned a bucket as well now. Hey Vanded, look, some bad guys over here, they're fighting. But uh, I thought they were spanning, but now they're not longer spanning. And Vanded! Wanna wear this? Haha, <laughs> what are you doing picking up Vanded? You're very funny. So messy. Alright. But the ultrasonic objective didn't seem to do anything. Oh wait, I think it might have given more speed. Hmm. Caffeinated. Why? Okay, why am I caffeinated? Too fast. What do you... What do you mean? 